Was good, you ugly mother It's currently 1.30 in the afternoon and I just arrived at the California Delta after paying a small visit to Headwaters Kayak. The reason why I went to their store today is because there was an alignment issue with my kayak seat and it turns out that my kayak was actually warped due to some manufacturing defect and thankfully my yak has warranty so they replaced it, gave me a new one, same model, same color, all that good shit. So to everyone who works at Headwaters, thank you guys for being so kind and so helpful. Your customer service is always A1. Okay, now with that being said, it's time for me to go set up everything and head out onto the water. It's currently high tide right now, and my plan is to throw the jig around all day, and hopefully I'll stick a couple nice ones. We'll see what happens. Catch y'all in a minute. chatterbait but I didn't I chose to bring my frog rod instead and that's a big mistake <laughs> there's one there's one there's a good one there's a good one oh, he's not bad well, a good one but he's not bad get the net <sighs> I don't want to lose them. <laughs> now I put the net in a better spot so that I don't lose these fish. Woo! There we go. Finally. Fresh one of the day. Only took me, uh, I don't know, uh, two hours. <laughs> My God, has it been slow. But it's, it's worth it, man. The grind paid off. Oh, look at that. Nice ass fish. And uh, yes, there is some strange creaking noise coming from the dock because it's a bit windy. Current's kind of strong. As you can uh, tell, my kayak's getting blown away. Uh, it's drifting away, I should say, because of the wind. So yeah, I should really should have brought my chatterbait out today. It definitely would have um, helped. So, oh well, I didn't bring it, so it is what it is, but hey, skunks out, awesome. Okay, chubby boy, thanks for the fight. See ya. Man, the bite is tough as f today. I've only managed to catch one fish in a span of three hours and after I caught that little chunky keeper I haven't gotten a single bite and honestly I really don't want to bring out the drop shot rod but it looks like I'm going to have to I'm gonna keep on tossing the jig for the next 30 minutes and if I can't get another fish within that time frame then I'm going to have to bring out my loyal ass side hoe miss drop shot the jig rod is my main hoe by the way just so we clear on that and the frog rod is the useless bit <laughs> now nah, I'm playing but uh yeah I'm gonna keep on grinding and hopefully I can catch a couple more lodges we'll see what happens I'll catch y'all in a minute there's one feels nice Feels decent. Yeah. He's decent. Oh. What? The hell? <laughs> well, I did not expect this. I'll be damned. This thing fought like a one pound uh, largemouth. Oh. <laughs> wow. That is a surprise. Oh, oh, never caught a uh, sunfish, a bluegill, on a drop shot. <laughs> First time this ever happened to me. Awesome. All right, Bubba, thanks for the fight. See ya. There's one. Wow, oh, that's a bass. Get your ass in here. <laughs> yeah. 
another bass another large large mouth ha ha finally god damn Whew, it's the end of the day finally caught my second largey of the day holy shit this dude clearly ain't a biggin but uh I'll definitely take it i ain't gonna complain at all any fish is a good fish for me today <laughs> Will this hook come out or do I have to get the pliers for your ass? Will you chill? There we go. I got it out. <laughs> Alright, little man. Thanks for the fight. See ya. There's one. Pretty little dude. Come here, bubba. Alright. Chill, chill, chill. Okay. Alright. There we go. Another Lodgy. Awesome. See ya. There's one. guys are all dinks oh chill out bud chill out I'm gonna unhook you real mother quick like a that and uh, yeah there we go another LMB large mouth whoop Stop. decided to flop off time for him to go home <laughs> and it's time for me to go home too shit it's getting dark it's gonna take me at least 45 minutes to get back to the lawn tram. God damn. Woo! <laughs> Folks, I'm back home now after a brutal ass f***ing day of fishing. The bite was super f***ing tough throughout the entire day and most of the fish that I caught were dinks except for that one decent keeper that I caught on the Jiggy Jig Jig. Truth be told, I'm pretty disappointed in today's results but I'd rather have a mediocre day than a complete shit fast. On the bright side though, at least my new Slayer 10 is not warped and does not have any seat problems whatsoever, which is a very, very good thing. Okay, now with that being said, it's time for me to go take a shower and then hit the sack. So I'll see you guys on my next fishing trip. Peace out, motherfucker.